Hello friends, I am Shyam Yadav and welcome to my channel iTech Warrior. Friends, in this video we will understand abstract class and interface. So let's start. So now we start the difference between abstract class and interface. Friends, I already create a video on abstract class and interface separately in great detail with example. So the link in the description box, please watch these videos. So now we start a point wise abstract class and interface so the first point is uh, abstract keyword is used to create abstract class whereas interface keyword is used to create interface second point is uh, abstract class contain abstract methods and non abstract methods whereas interface contain only abstract methods third point is uh, abstract class declaration of abstract members with abstract keywords whereas in interface declaration of abstract members without abstract keyword because every member in interface is abstract by default and the fourth point is multiple inheritance is not achieved by abstract class whereas multiple inheritance is achieved by interface Fifth point is abstract class contain a constructor whereas interface does not contain constructor. Sixth point is abstract class can contain static members whereas interface does not contain static members. Seventh point is abstract class contain different type of access modifiers like public, private, protected etc whereas interface contains only public access modifiers because every member in the interface is public by default public eighth point is a class can only use one abstract class whereas a class can use multiple interface it means uh, a class inherit only one abstract class whereas a class can use multiple interface it means a class inherit multiple inheritance multiple sorry multiple interface ninth point is a abstract class contain fields variables whereas interface does not contain fields and variables tenth point is in abstract class while implementing abstract members in child class it requires to use override modifiers whereas in interface while implementing abstract members in child class it does not require to use override modifier so these are the important points uh, between abstract class and interface here is the syntax of abstract class and interface in abstract class uh, we declared uh, abstract class with abstract keyword abstract and class and the name and inside the abstract class we declare abstract members and uh, non abstract members here is the syntax of uh, interface interface and interface name and inside the interface we use only abstract members thank you for watching if you like my video Please subscribe our YouTube channel and press the bell icon for upcoming video notification.